Olympia game is full of strange choices rather than more strange choices than more Nick Cage's strange IMDb. choices than Nick Cage's IMDb page. I think was what they were trying to say. <laughs> the intros are not all gold. That's okay. okay. John That's is standing by with another edition of Wiki. Because this is the part that matters. Yeah, it's because. Nicholas Cage makes some strange choices in the I movies see. that he I see what that he's going. Yes, through. I see. I see. Uh -huh. You know, <laughs> we're not all gold. Yeah. That's all right. That's I all right. didn't write it. All right. Uh, <laughs> if you need a refresher, it goes like this. I give you three <laughs> famous people who have something in common, and then I give you a semi-obscure factoid from their Wikipedia page, and you have to tell me which one it applies to. Today's guys, we are celebrating an anniversary. Oh. Oh. Today marks 37 years since the Terminator hit theaters. Oh, wow, really? 37 years? I saw it in theaters. Yeah, so we have Linda Hamilton, Arnold Schwarzenegger, Who and the director, you, James Cameron. All right. Are you ready? Let's do this. Question number one. Whose father questioned their paternity? Meaning oh. questioned, I'm not sure I'm your dad. Oh, wow. Um, <laughs> uh... I'm going to go with Linda Hamilton. I am too, because I get a feeling there was some weird stuff that happened. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Well, guys, Arnold Schwarzenegger's dad, not a great guy. He was apparently very strict. Yeah. Uh, he wasn't afraid to paddle the kids rather hard. Uh, and he was a Nazi. And then there's that. Yeah, there's that. There's that part, too. Yeah. Uh, on top of that, Schwarzenegger has said that his dad blatantly favored Arnold's brother, Meinhardt. <laughs> It's a good thing Arnold became the star, not Meinhardt. Oh, yeah. gosh. Might yeah. be like Terminator starring Meinhardt Schwarzenegger. Oh, oh. Meinhardt. Uh, he says that's because his father did not believe that Arnold was really what? his son. Oh, no. Seriously. Oh, Daddy. Come on. The irony there is that when Schwarzenegger grows up, wouldn't you want to be like, yeah, those are my genes. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> exactly. Unclear whether he actually was his son. Well, and then oh. more irony because... Schwarzenegger had his own paternity yeah, situation say, later. Some... I'm the not bringing up all stuff, story. I'm just saying. And he was a Nazi. <laughs> um, and I guess that came up quite a bit during the campaign. And he, like, yeah, and he, yeah. in, in uh, Arnold Schwarzenegger had been a um, supporter of the Wiesenthal Museum down in, in um, LA and had them, like, investigate it for him and stuff. Yeah. So he's not, like, shying from it. Yeah. Look, those were the times in Austria. Wow. Wow. Okay. <laughs> uh, question number two Who has been married the most times? out of these three? Uh, that would be James Cameron. That is my guess as well, James Cameron. Any particular reason? I just know that he's been married a bunch of times. I just feel like I've not heard a bunch. Mm -hmm. Like I, I'm familiar with Schwarzenegger's, mm -hmm. and I've not heard a bunch about hers. Mm -hmm. um, so I just guess James In fact, Cameron, wasn't James know. Cameron married to somebody on your panel? Then? Well, let's find out here. Mm. Arnold Schwarzenegger and Maria Shriver divorced in 2017 after the aforementioned mm -hmm. in Bakersfield. I lived there at the time. <laughs> <laughs> Remember the story broke like when I was leaving work? And I was like, oh, that's crazy. And next morning, I come, it was here? It was here? <laughs> yeah. yeah. All right, so they divorced in 2017 after more than 30 years of marriage. That is his only marriage, Arnold Schwarzenegger. Right. He is not remarried. Linda Hamilton and James Cameron were married to each other oh, at were. one point. Okay. Mm -hmm. right. But she was also married to actor Bruce Abbott. Okay. So that's two for okay, her. Okay. Okay. Cameron was also married to filmmaker Catherine Bigelow. Yep. So that's two for him. Uh huh. Uh -huh. To go with Sharon Williams, Gail Hurd, and his current wife, Susie <laughs> Amos, for a grand total of five marriages. Wow. Around the world and I, yeah, yeah. I mean, at one point, you're just like, you know, that's not for me. Yeah. Like, marriage isn't for me. You know. And a lot of those people he actually worked with, like Gail and Hurd, you know, from the movies and stuff like that. So, like, oh. if you're in a movie with him yeah. and you're working with him, do you have to propose? Is that what's going on? <laughs> yeah, a, a little known fact, he was married to Schwarzenegger for a while. <laughs> I mean, why not? Okay, uh, yeah. so, Cody, are you two for two? Um, I think we both missed the first yeah, one. Oh. Missed the first one. Yeah. All right, so the relish is so, But Cody's No, bad. the relish is fine. Uh, if I'm ever going to be a game show host, I'm going to have to do better at keeping track of the score. Yes. That's what this thing is for. Yeah, well, nobody <laughs> Tells me though. <laughs> they will tell you mm. what the score is. They just they just butcher the intro to the segment. <laughs> 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 Sorry, Angelo. Yeah. But it happened. Yeah, actually he writes great intros. But, he does, he really does. Uh, just a typo on that one. Okay. Uh, question number three. Who said that they voted for Schwarzenegger when he ran for governor? Uh, Arnold Schwarzenegger voted for Well, I mean, other than him. We, oh. can, we will assume that he voted that he for voted himself. himself. So I'm giving you guys a 50-50. Yeah. This is a, uh, can't, so we can assume that they both live in California? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Um, 
but who said Lindahan. they voted? Publicly said they voted for him. I'm going to go with James Cameron. I'll go with Linda. Okay. Okay. Let's Let's split. Split. Well, guys, uh, as Cody mentioned, we can assume that Arnold Schwarzenegger voted for himself. So that leaves us with Hamilton and Cameron. Both have said they are Democrats. Mm -hmm. And if you remember, Schwarzenegger ran as a Republican. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Cameron is a pretty vocal environmentalist, and he endorsed Hillary Clinton in 2016. But when Schwarzenegger was running for governor back in 2003, he won the support of his co-worker, Linda Hamilton, <laughs> at least publicly. She said she voted for him. I don't know that Jim Cameron ever commented on it, or if he uh, did, it's not in his Wikipedia page. I see. I see. All right. Still crazy that he was our governor. It happened. It happened. Yeah. I was living back east, this, back east at the time going, what is going on out there? <laughs> and remember, he couldn't smoke cigars inside, so they oh, built a special yeah. tent outside. Yes. And every once in a while, we'd take the shot of the Capitol and say, hey, is there smoke coming out of there? Is there nope. smoke coming? I, uh, I, I interviewed him one time when I was working in Bakersfield. Uh -huh. was shocked to find out he's my height. Okay, so that was the thing that we were talking about um, when, he was, when he was serving as governor. Mm -hmm. You know, the door to the governor's uh, yeah. area is huge, huge door. And he would stand in front of the door, and because he's shorter, mm -hmm. that door would well, make him look thanks. even shorter. <laughs> <laughs> it's so weird. People were like shocked to find out. Yeah, how. I mean, I'm, I'm like five. Like he's a he's he is yeah. Small. I'm like five. Knows you're six like, seven, Joe. Yeah, I just so. assumed he was like six foot two or more. Mm. Yeah, well, yeah, because he's the Terminator. Why would he be? All right, guys. They use that was Wicked Who. A lot of low angle shots of the Terminator. <laughs> exactly.